astrobus out there. This is Pete Leung of Photo Shisa here in beautiful Okinawa on one of our little local beaches here today. Uh, today I'm going to talk to you about uh, some new toys from the great folks at Expo Imaging with their Rogue Flash Benders. They were nice enough to send me out some of their new gear and I've uh, had a little test of it and I think it's pretty damn cool. So I'd like to show you some of the new stuff today. So basically, uh, Rogue Flash Benders, in case you don't know, uh, are something you can attach to your speed light and they're a great alternative to carrying around bigger, heavy, uh, bulky soft boxes, numberellas. They still allow you to really uh, diffuse your light and shape it in ways that you just can't when you've just got a single flash like this. They open up a lot of uh, creative possibilities and things like that. But uh, here we have today anyway, their new extra large XL flash bender, which looks like this. It's, it's pretty big, it's a good size. And uh, it also comes in their pro kit with uh, an extra panel, which can just velcro on the front there. It has a silver edge to kick back a little bit more light. Or you can reverse that and have it black if you want to use it to reduce light or use it as a flag. Also super handy. Uh, but one of the other main features I love about this is they now have a front diffusion panel which can pop on the front of the flash bender itself. So I'm just going to pop it onto my uh, speed light here. Today I'm using a, a cheap Yongnuo, Yongnuo YN560 Mark III which I actually love. It, it works fine and at less than a hundred bucks you can get set up with a speed light and a trigger. It's got built-in wireless. It's great. So uh, manual only. No TTL but who needs that. So I'm just going to pop it onto my flash here and then you can go ahead and you can shape it and bend it. It has new rods in the bottom now which allow you to shape it even better. You can turn it into a snoot, bend it down, all that kind of good stuff. And then you can go ahead and pop on your new front diffusion panel which will turn it into a softbox. So I'm just going to velcro it onto the top there, put down a couple of the little buttons at the top, uh, pop in this little strap into the velcro, Make sure she's secured nice and tight as it is a little bit windy today. There we go. So as you can see, you can get it all set up in just a few seconds. And now you've got quite a good size little softbox. Let's see if we can get it to fire there. There we go. Not sure if you can see that. It's firing just nicely. And it does have a little extra diffusion panel right in front of the flash head to help spread out the light so you don't get any hot spots and things like that. I hear that it spreads it out quite well. You only get like about half a stop difference of light between the center of the flash bender and right out to the edges. So it's a nice even spread of light. Okay, so that's the, that's the large one there. And they do also come in the large. That's the large size right there. Again, with the diffusion panel. Those are sold separately by the way, but definitely a good upgrade. And then you can get your smaller, the S size right there. Just a little fella there. You can pop in your pocket. A nice little way to soften up the light. Uh, one more great thing about the XL, the new one, which I will show you right now. You can take off that diffusion panel once again. And hopefully that won't blow away. Let me pop that back on the flash real quick for you. And show you one very cool new feature okay here it is here the thin thin diffuser which will allow it to turn into a strip light check this out let me turn around to the side there so you can see a little better it just pops onto the top like so it will hook over there there we go Just like that. Let's turn it back around. And as you can see, we've got a pretty good size strip light now, which you can set up nice and easily on the go. Again, it'll fold up and fit in your camera bag, no worries at all. And that'll be great for giving you uh, a nice edge or a rim light on your subject's shoulders and arms and things like that. And look at that. It all comes in the one kit. Fantastic, folds up nice and small, super light, great for traveling with and uh, just a really good build quality. It's 
I've used uh, other smaller ones for quite a few years now and they haven't fallen apart, they work great. Uh, it's just really fantastic stuff. So that's it for today. Check out uh, the Rogue flash benders and other great stuff from Expo Imaging at expoimaging.com. And once again, thanks very much for watching. If you'd like to follow my stuff, as always, follow me at uh, Facebook at facebook.com slash photoshisa or www.photoshisa.com. Thanks for watching.